sound of that, don't I? Used to spend my nights out in a bar room. Liquor was the only love I know. And then he goes to your smooth. It's Tennessee whiskey. You're a sweet strawberry wine. What's up, guys? Hey, man. Hope things are going well for you. Look, thanks to all you guys who've been watching Uncommon Beginner Guitar. I just wanted to show you a simple way. Let me cut this thing off my phone here and my watch. Um, to show you a simple way just to kind of get out and play and have fun. This is not the correct way to play. All right, these, some of these are, some of them aren't, but it will lead you to play in the right way. I have people comment sometimes, hey, tune your guitar, hey, this is the wrong note or all that. That's fine, and I appreciate it, and I get that. Um, but that's not what we're trying to do here. We're trying to get you playing right away. I wanna get you playing in 10 minutes. I wanna review real quick what we've gone over, okay? The guitar's been tuned. Notice I got it on the second fret today. I'll tell you why, because that's what, that's what Tennessee Whiskey's played in. All right, so let's go over our chords again. These two fingers, all right, the pinky on the bottom on the sixth string, I'm counting from the top down, one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, in the third fret, these squares, one, two, three. All right, so this pinky is going on the bottom string, third fret. Ring finger is going right above it on the second string. All right, so we got that. Remember, they never move. They will today. They will today, because we're going to learn a chord called A minor. All right, A minor. All right, if you're too young to vote, you're at A minor. I thought it was funny. But um, anyway, so RG. Bird finger, top string of the third fret, okay? And then uh, this finger, your index, on the second string, second fret, good smooth G sound. All right, pretty good. Oh, I didn't introduce you. Look, this is double, this is double J. All right, Jumbo Johnson. All right, I got this because uh, Jamie Johnson's one of my favorite uh, singers, and uh, he has a big old just joke won't hardly fit in my lap, but I love it anyway. So I'm trying to introduce some of the guitars I got here. I don't even, uh, what is the name, a guild maybe? I don't know. It's, what's up, G? That's all I got. So anyway, when we play that, what we're going to do is when we play Tennessee Whiskey, um, that's what I want you to do. By the end of this video, you should be able to play Tennessee Whiskey in 10 minutes. 10 minutes. Because see, these chords repeat. And I love a, a lot of songs do that. A lot of songs, the chorus, I mean, the, uh, oh, wait, the verses and then the chorus will actually do the, um, follow the same pattern. And this will too. A minor is a simple chord. Okay, we're gonna learn that, learn how to do that. Um, and uh, so what we wanna do is this one, it says here when I go to, I showed you before. Um, oh, well, come on, baby. I mean, uh, the, the app thing that I have is Ultimate Guitar. All right, and you see I just typed in up top, Tennessee Whiskey, and you'll see close where it says, it is on Capo, second fret. All right, which tells me that I'm going to have to, this is the Capo, take this and go down two squares. One, two, and I get it close to this as I can, close to this little ridge it's sticking out. So when I put it on, I want to kind of be straight with it. If it's off a little bit, it doesn't really matter. I mean, it looks like it's off here a little bit here now, okay? Now this becomes the end of the guitar. So our third fret that we play is now going to be these two fingers sliding out of this fret, right? And now this is our G, but it's a little bit higher, okay? All right, this is a G, and we're gonna go our G. And when we go our C, which is really a C at nine, um, you're going to drop it down one, this index finger, your bird finger down one, and hit five strings. We hit six on the G. All right. Hear the difference? All right. And then we're not going to do the D, the, the D today, so we're not going to mess with it. All right. But today, when we do, what we're going to do is slide it all right, to what we call A minor. This index finger, your index finger is going to go on the fifth string in the first fret. All right. Fifth string in the, fir in the first fret. All right. And your bird finger is gonna go on the third string, all right, third string in the second fret. And then your uh, ring finger is gonna go on the fourth string. So you have this look, um, let's see if you can see it or not. So um, one string there, all right, fifth string, first fret. Think about it, close as I can to the ridge. All right, then this bird finger is gonna be on the third string from the top, second fret, and then my ring finger is gonna be on the fourth string. So I'm getting this sound. And I'm hitting all five. Okay, you can already hear it. Um, now I'm hitting, I'm hitting five, yes. All right, so when I start Tennessee Whiskey up, all right, it's just the same. We'll just do a simple down strum because I think it makes it easier. 
um, especially if you're a beginner. This is for first beginners for, man, whether you're eight years old or 80, everybody. You're never too old to start playing the guitar. One thing, I've had some friends who are older really start wanting to play and they're like, hey, I'm picking this up. I love it, man. Um, it's so fun to learn these songs. And then when you do it, you just find yourself, you know, at the end of a long work day or something like that, you just come home and boom, just grab the guitar and start playing. So I'm gonna start with that G. All right, so I'm sliding down. And all the song is gonna do is repeat G, A minor, G, C, G. G, A minor, G, C, G. G, A minor, G, C, G, you get it. So we'll start with the G. Let's just go to the, the strum here at the beginning. Let's see if we can hear it. G. Now I'm gonna go to A minor. Okay, when I first talk about this finger here, index on the fifth string, first fret, bird on the third string and second fret, and the ring finger on the fourth string, the third fret, and five strings. Anybody G? Or five? Uh, about G? And I'll, I'll do like maybe I'll show bum, bum, and then get out of C. Back to G. So let's go, I'll do it a little bit quicker. All right, so it's like, um, strum a G, G, going into A minor. A minor, back up to G, stay on the A minor, G, C, G, I mean C, G, so it should be G, G, C, G, all right, so it's like G, I used to spend my nights out on A minor, in a ballroom, and we're just down strumming. Look who was the only love I know. Back to G. No. Back to C. Because I went C, G, repeats again. That's the great thing about music. I never realized that until I started playing. All these things just repeat. So if I can memorize those few things. When you rescued me from reaching for the bottom. Brought me back. Still on A minor. Too far, but G. C, G. And he goes right into the chorus. All right, so back on the G for the chorus. You're a smooth. Stay down, strum it. It's Tennessee, A minor. Biscay. You're a sweet strawberry white, G. right back to the same pattern G a minor G C G all right you can do this on the ultimate guitar tab you can see it it tells you when to come in on the song you always want one it's a glass a minor and a I stay strong on your love all the G G G C G and you just do the whole song that way it's so simple now if I do if I'm and then start picking around now. All right, we've done this long enough where you can start picking around. Um, I don't have a pattern for picking. I just know I'm on a G, so I'll just strum through some stuff like. G. I can hit any of those strings in those five that I'm playing. Remember we said the A minor is the down strum. I'll go to G. Here's the C. G. And if you want to just practice some up strumming and down strumming stuff, it's like. <laughs> Nothing to it, right? Hey, man, you can do this. You can do this. I love doing this. I love teaching it. Um, I'm glad people are watching. I'm getting great feedback on it. It's not a very hard instrument to play. I picked this thing up for 20 years and kept putting it down because you know why? I get too close. You don't want to get too close to these. I get too close to them and I get this. Probably like you're getting them. All right, it hurt my fingers. It doesn't take long and you get calluses on the end. All right, you can do it. I believe you can do it. And I hope that um, everybody learns this song and has a great time with it. Um, hope the things in your life are going well. 
Uh, still want to be praying for everything going on in the Middle East. I'm praying for you. I love you. I can't tell you much. It's, it's humbling, and I'm appreciative of you guys just watching and tuning in. If you don't get it right, just take this video and rewind it back. Rewind it back. Take that. Rewind it back. You know, um, you can do that. Rewind them back. Go back and practice the stuff. We've been practicing some little drills. It's like we have our G here. Strong. Drop the two fingers. All right. Just keep strumming them. You want to play that A minor, the new chord we learned today? All right. And let's work on this in those three. C, it's only three chords. All right, G, C, we already know. All we got to do is put that A minor in. Now you got the whole song, Tennessee Whiskey, one of the most famous songs of all time. So I'm excited for you. I love you. And uh, thank you guys for supporting us. If you like this, please share it with a friend. Please subscribe and comment. If there's some songs that you want me to do that you want to learn, please let me know. I'll walk through. I'll do them. Um, some are more complicated than others. Some are easier. So anyway, the uncommon beginner way to play the guitar. Hey, I love you. I'm praying for you. Thanks for keeping us in your prayers and praying for our ministry. And um, and we want to change the world. Hey, you know, when they asked the teacher, they asked Jesus, you know, what what is favorite two commandments? What are his most important commandments? Love the God, love the Lord thy God with all your heart and love thy neighbor. All right, right now we're loving thy neighbor. All right, I want you to have fun. Use this. Go get them. All right, what you playing the song by next week? Ten minutes is all it takes. Love you.